this tree right here we're looking at right here the witnesses were coming eastbound on this highway riding up the mountain here and they saw what they saw days by going off the road as they both saw it and uh, I came up here investigating the area here where the uh, where the subject possibly ran back up because they the witnesses they have gone up the road here turned around and had to come back for a second look by the time they made it back here the subject was gone the subject was well over eight feet judging from the comparison that I did with my hand raised over my head yeah uh, they said it was twice the width of me and uh, seeing this break on this tree that's over seven and a half foot tall and seeing some of the impressions that I found as I worked my way up here and some odd but yet interesting structures and formations up through here so and a couple of the tracks I found appear to almost have toes in them so um, a lot of this area has been tore up I'm sure bears come down here but a couple of the tracks I found do point towards possible Bigfoot so um, again the witnesses are on audio um, I'm doing this little uh, investigation uh, video just to show you the area and what kind of highway we're dealing with but again you see how wide the tree is there subject the tree was too small to hide the subject so and of course on the other side it drops straight down it's a steep drop So, it would have been nice to see a uh, squatch come and work around this area. And I see something right up there that almost appears to be like a uh, teepee structure up there. Which, you can't zoom, see it if I zoom in. So I won't bother, I'll take it back out. Very interesting. So, uh, but, uh, what they saw was uh, around 9 o'clock in the morning. Sunny day. Standing inside here right off the highway. 